You know, the thing is about content creation, we don't, as audience members, want to be convinced that we need something. Because think about in your life when you try to convince your kids of something or your partner of something, like people are just not generally receptive to trying to be convinced about something. They put up a block. And if your content is kind of in that convincing vibe, your audience isn't going to receive it. What do I mean by that? I mean, are you trying to get your audience to be convinced that they need you or that they have a problem even because a lot of your audience members don't yet know that they have a problem or maybe you're trying to convince your audience that they can trust you. And so I just want you to think about your content that you're putting out into the world. Does it feel exhausting to put it out there? Is nobody interacting with it? Is it not resonating with people? Are you not um, getting engagement? It might be because you have this convincing energy like, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nobody is attracted to that. Now, you might not have ever thought about this before. So you don't have to like should all over yourself and shame all over yourself that you're doing something wrong. But I would love for you to go back and take a look at your content. Are you convincing your people to do something, to feel a certain way, to understand a certain thing? If you are, my guess is it's content creation has felt really hard for you. So let's talk about a way to start thinking about this in a different manner. What do you do when all of your content is feeling convincing? Well, just start talking in a different way that is less about convincing and pushing or pulling and more about reflecting. I want you to think of your content as being a mirror for the people that you wanna work with, the people that you want to help. Does your content mirror what they're struggling with, right? So like this video is all about, does content creation feel like you're pushing a boulder up a hill? Do you feel like you're just always trying to get somebody on board? And if you, if you are doing that, you are exhausted. My guess is you are hiding from content creation. So like, I really wanna mirror that for you. Are you mirroring what your audience is struggling with? Are you talking about their pain in a way that they talk about it? Are you trying to make them understand that they have a problem and they're really not interested in even admitting they have a problem? These are the things I want you to think about in terms of content creation and how to get out of it. You simply have to look at your content with a more objective eye. I know that you probably think you're doing everything you could be doing, but you might have to do less. So wouldn't it be great to do less content? So just consider that. Let me know if you have any questions about this topic. Convincing energy is kind of repellent and we don't want to repel your people. We want them to see themselves in your content. So just hold up a mirror for your people. I swear it makes content creation a hell of a lot easier. I hope this has been helpful. I'm Jen Liddy. I'm a content creation specialist and and I would love to hear your questions. So feel free to drop them in the comments below. Bye.